We're getting these containers ready for your summer garden and a couple of things you need to do before you actually get those containers out there and getting them ready. You want to make sure you really clean out an empty container pretty well so that the new soil or any kind of problems you had last season are out the door. Another thing you want to make sure when you find a container that you absolutely love, make sure that it has an opening on the bottom. This one had a little plug, you just have to unscrew it and now I'm ready to go. That will help all the water drain out of this pot and keep these plants healthy but keep the plug you never know when you need to put that back in now I like to lighten the load just a little bit so instead of just putting the soil right down on the bottom of this container you can also use something like rocks that'll help keep the, the soil for draining throughout the season but I like to make it a little bit lighter for me to move around my patio so I like to start with a big layer of newspaper and I just find it from my recycle bin and you fill it up about halfway really thick of your newspaper. You can also use packing peanuts. And then I go to my garden and I get a little bit of a heavier soil that is it's a little bit sandy in my neighborhood. And I put that on the bottom, right on top of the newspaper. Really only about an inch or two for this kind of a container. Because the top part of the soil, I want to be lush and beautiful, brand new soil that I'm getting from my home and garden center. I want to get some potting soil. This also has a little bit of perlite in it, these little white beads that help keep the soil from getting too tight throughout the summertime. And you can see here it's nice and it's moist. Another thing that I want to do just to make sure that my plants will be healthy as we get into the season, I like to add some kind of a hydration helper. This is called Soil Moist. There's a lot of different products out there, but you just take a little sprinkle you put it in your soil and each one of these little beads will hold some moisture in it and that way the roots will be nice and moist all summer long and it'll help your plants thrive throughout the summer and even in the really hot months of July and August. Get out there, get growing.